So you've created across the Pacific and the Indian Ocean, well, it's the Indian Ocean, I guess, your own crescent from East Africa through Dubai, through Pakistan, down into Southeast Asia. Yeah. So let's turn to the domestic market. Now, you mentioned yourself that you, you and perhaps you, you may want to revise this, I don't know, but you mentioned that you were kind of reaching the limits of what you can do in the domestic market. Is this, is this really true? Have you reached the limits of growth here? No, not really. You see, I have immense uh, uh, you know, uh, belief in the leadership of the UAE. Uh, you know, if you look at the last four or five years, for that matter, um, you know, the world has gone through all sorts of uh, global financial crisis. You know, we've had economic slowdowns in many countries within the world. Uh, within the UAE itself, you know, we have not been insulated from the global uh, economy. We've seen commodity prices falling. We've seen oil volatility. We've seen an impact of that on the liquidity situation and asset quality. Despite all of this, if you look at every financial institution within the UAE, it has become stronger and it has actually gained momentum and it has gone a step further. The strategy of Dubai Islamic Bank, we embarked on a growth strategy, Robin, in 2014. Now, that was the peak of this mini crisis that we are talking about. Falling commodity prices, oil price volatility, uh, impact on liquidity and so on. But what did we do? We put our step forward and we started growing. We embarked on a growth strategy. If you had any uh, uh, analyst or any consultant for that matter coming to you, he would advise you, this is not the time. You've got to consolidate, you've got to take a step back. We did quite the opposite. Mm. Why is because we believed in the country, we believe in the leadership, and we knew that the, the reliance on oil was not the only thing that the country ever did. Mm. It diversified. So if you look at global uh, macro uh, economics of the UAE, you will see that UAE diversified its, uh, its uh, mm. uh, uh, reliance mm. on, on mm. oil with other sectors. Yeah. That is exactly what the bank did. We started looking at sectors and did not put all our eggs in one basket. If you, if you, I always say that you know, if you mm. want to have something you never had, you have to do something that you never have. And that is exactly that we did. 2014, 15, 16, we grew. And I feel that if we did that in the most tumultuous of time, within the last three years, 17, 18 and 19 are going to be far relatively easier. And I see that there is domestic growth on the agenda for not just Dubai Islamic Bank, but every institution that has got this uh, right.